One, adjust pole clamp. Fix the machine on IV pole. Connect power cord to AC power source. The AC-DC indicator light on top left of machine will be on. 2. Press power key to turn on machine. 3. Close the flow clip. Connect IV set to fluid bottle. Insert intake pipe. Squeeze the drip chamber to fill with half of liquid. Open flow clip and let fluid flow to the tip of needle, then close flow clip again. 4. Press door lock to open the door. Upward the anti-free flow clamp and place it at top of right side plastic block. Put drip chamber at left side of machine. Pull straight the IV set and install it to the groove from left to right. Press the tubing in the middle of pump body and make it against the peristaltic fingers. Press two top corners of pump door to close the door and then open flow clip. 5. When there is no air bubble in the tube, the green indicator light will be on after well installation of IV set, which means the machine is ready for infusion. When there is air bubble in the tube, the green indicator light is not on. Keep pressing bolus key to exhaust the air bubble. 6. The default infusion mode is rate mode. If drip mode is needed, press switch key to switch the infusion mode. Input flow rate, drip rate, volume limit as per actual demand. If it wanted to infuse the whole bottle of fluid, keep the VTBI volume limit as zero milliliters. 7. Press Start key to start infusion after confirm all parameters settings are correct. If a high flow rate is needed, keep pressing and hold on bolus key. After releasing the finger, the flow rate returns to original rate. 8. Green indicator light keeps flashing during infusion. LCD screen displays info such as flow rate, volume limit, accumulated volume, and remaining time. Press stop key to stop infusion. Press start key to start infusion again if needed. After infusion completion, the machine will give over alarm and start KVO function automatically. Press stop key to stop infusion. Press Clear, Soft Key to clear accumulated volume. 9. Press Power Key, about 2 seconds to turn off the machine. Make calibration and verification when changed to a new brand of infusion set. 1. The infusion pump uses IV set under brand of Boon for factory setting, default setting. See tube A at top left corner of LCD. If changing to the other brand of infusion set, please do accuracy calibration before using it. 2. Press and hold on stop key first, then press first soft key on top left, entering parameter setting interface. Press tube soft key, press plus or minus key to choose type of infusion set. Press Enter key to save it. 3. After choose type of infusion set, press Accuracy Soft key to enter Accuracy Calibration Interface. Put needle into 10 ml syringe or measuring cup. Press Start key. The machine will work at 150 ml per hour and volume limit of 10 ml. During calibration process, the green indicator light is always on and no flashing. After 10 milliliters finish infusion, machine gives one do sound to alert. Measuring the flown out liquid in syringe or measuring cup. Input this actual flown out volume on real text of calibration interface. Then press enter key to save the value and exit. 
the calibration of this brand of IV set is complete. 4. After calibration, press and hold on stop key first, then press first soft key on top left to quit parameter setting interface. Set flow rate at 150 milliliters per hour. VTBI at 10 milliliters to check if actual infusion volume is about 10 milliliters. 5. Before using drip mode, it should input 1 milliliter equivalent to how many drops to machine. The number of drops is in accordance to package of infusion set. Press and hold on stop key first, then press first soft key on top left. Entering parameter setting interface, press D slash ML soft key. Input the number of drops equivalent to one milliliter. Press enter key to save, exit. Then press stop key and first soft key on top left together to return to main menu. 6. Set drip rate at 50 drops per minute after VTBI and VTBI as 5 milliliters. Start infusion. Check actual number of drops within the 5 milliliters. If the actual number of drops counted is too different from presetting 1, it needs to adjust the drops per 1 milliliter value.